Hehehe, he, he. inu mpala menti muliro, muliro, kwenyini Mpu um, uga, speaker Anita Amongi, abaka baba tabu kidi, baba nabi demaso Baga mpala menti wa jeso nyuweba koe Aba menye wama teka mpala menti wanga iba jikulira Katu gendeo, tubifune, hivi gambo na uvira bideko Come here to make my voice and to say If we don't act over this matter Meaning we are condoning, we are encouraging corruption in Uganda. And there is no way we shall clear corruption here in the Uganda. But the best way is to call a spade a spade. Mm. Why are we fearing to call a spade a spade here? Eh? May I call upon the president also to come in? He should not look into these things and say it is a play. No. We are having a bad record as Ugandans. What are we doing? No, when we have people like departments of judiciary, we have it here. That can, that can advise the speaker, that can advise the president, that can advise even the clerk. I was even in the clerk's office and I told the clerk that the abuse comes to your office because you are a technical person and you are keeping quiet with this, this issue. Why are you keeping quiet? Why can't you advise these people who are chairing the parliament? Why can't you advise them such that they correct and say, no, this is wrong? And if we don't correct ourselves, how shall the community the committee, the, the people we represent down there, how will they perceive us? Which message shall we be giving them as we are getting back to maybe do some other campaigns? Campaigns maybe to bring development to what? That, this issue has even gone down. That's why you see PDM. There, is, there are issues in the PDM, eh? which we need to correct from the top. And when we are reaching it down, things will be fine. Eh? Who doesn't want development? All of us want development, and we are here to develop our people. I thank you. Mm. Mm. They don't have strength. <laughs> Sad day for some of us, the petitioners. You are aware that today, Monday, is the last day, the 14th day of our petition to have been put on the other paper. The same speaker, Anita Among, has decided not to have this matter debated. Parliament of Uganda has already lost integrity. The country knows, the world knows, we are now calling upon the Chief Justice, Owen Dolo, to wake up. He needs to check his institution, the judiciary. It has started losing. It has started getting compromised by forces from this parliament. This ruling, this ruling here, we call upon the Chief Justice to review it, whether it's genuine or not. These fools took themselves to court. These thieves, they took themselves to court. Created their own case. And it was passed in their favor. This ruling has nothing to do with our petition. It has nothing to do with our petition. Our petition was on grounds provided by the rules of procedure of parliament. Rule 110. And also, and our, our, our petition has other grounds. We are not looking at the service award alone. We are looking at issues of misconduct. What are these issues? Commissioners giving themselves illegal trips with their spouses. Somebody is going 
away for a trip, benchmarking trip for 30 days, which is not there in actual sense. Illegal recruitment in this parliament, where the commissioners have their own relatives, sisters, brothers, husbands. These are all matters of misconduct. So our motion is still relevant. It must appear on the order paper. Nobody is going to fool us in this parliament. Mm. If you don't know to interpret the law, if you don't know how to interpret our petition, then you should hire machineries or lawyers to come and interpret for you. There is no way. It's uncalled for. Now, parliament was adjourned last week to Tuesday tomorrow. The speaker herself has written tomorrow's parliament to be on 28th in Gulu. There is no regional parliamentary sitting that we are going to accept. It is safety. It is safety of taxpayers in Monday. It is safety of taxpayers in Monday. Which special message is going to be sent in Gulu? That cannot be sent from this parliament here centrally. Nobody knows the budget. They are actually trying to account for already stolen money. If not, where is the budget for the regional parliaments? Everything is hidden. So we are telling you, Ugandans, reject it. Gulu will be a battlefield. Gulu will be a battlefield. We are calling upon Ugandans, the taxpayers, to come out and block that sitting. It is uncalled for. We are not in support of any regional parliamentary sitting. I call upon people in Barara to block it. People in Mbale should block it. People in Masaka rise up and block it. Stealing of your money, taxpayers' money. All the sittings, those regional sittings can be done from here in this parliament. It's just a matter of saying, on Tuesday, we shall deal with the matters of Northern Uganda. On Wednesday, we shall deal with the matters in the other paper of matters of what? Western Uganda and Barara. It is easy to give a day and deal with the matters of Mbale. I mean, Eastern, in Mbale, instead of going to Mbale. Why you move? Why you spend money on accommodation? Why you spend money on ABCD? Why you give members allowance, extra money? To move to Gulu? My age. For what? Ugandans, please, 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 wake up. Don't allow those regional parliamentary sittings. Don't, Ugandans, don't. It's too much. It is too much. You cannot do that. We are standing for our motion. We need a debate. Why is the speaker not being neutral? Why is Anita Mong not neutral? Why is she trying to take sides? If all fails, we shall take her to court. We shall take the speaker Anita Mong to court. We shall take her to court. What's the space? We are not giving up. We shall fight for the rights of Ugandans until the end in this parliament. This 11th parliament, we are not giving up. We are not. Please, we thank you. No, we can't allow it. This is too much. Me, the Amhaji Bashir Lubega, Sempa. I represent the people of Mubende municipality. You know. Hmm. Ah, you Uganda, ya fe. Beba kulembeze, ba fe. Ya betu wa detu esi genyo, betu wa detu linao Yeranga tulo oza, ntipa kuli li rafe Bafayo jetuli, bafayo kurafe Nyenga bobe li ba, bali kubia bobo ka Nuzo uli la speaker waza mbira ba no mzanyo Kana chino chintu chigazi Yonge lo chete jirize Oli okote ndeleze chagula nyintika saja goli kagezi Chagula nyona ine chintu chea bala Chintu chea buka Echari chigendo kumulia Chitia Chagula njibali wa muteze akalipo, akagwemu, katisinga jari mairo lukumi. Jeno msume na adewe jia gamba, gurupi ya chagula njia kujimara huu, echi itaha guru otega hansi. 
Ngaba muga mba agina kuchikolatia. Suwa so, inauwa nubwa mpuga wei. Agina kwe sanita mongi. Asensele. Gusoku lawe katisawa ino wetuli. Aba antubanja waka parlamenti. Abe kutuda kuchagula nyawali ne mpuga. Luachi. Mazongo to. Walua abantu beruwele. Aba waka beruwele. Wali yunga wabili umuchala no muami. Bali kumpuga. Uh, walu nawa oweli oweentewe. Segona. Walaba. Oromosita agina mba waka kunga kumi. Mpuga. Biyara mazo kuchusa. Kati singa wa mungiri miyake milala. Evidi. Nechi tundu nga ilopu. Mwani gezo tuka mkuro ndo kudako. Nga chakwetacha inao ground. Nga vyo naba vyo nonye. Mwishitegede. Na yeka kati. Aba mba ina mwaka fansoni. Omundi zanyi msewe nungari ya zanyi. Ya gudiba na guo. Nga ita musipika. Chovola wa balu wa anukla. Nga tebala visa mza. Wentino kai. Kana hati nga chai. Kama tuwa chitegede already. Kani wana kula batia, ni wana kwa hata ochi mtuchaba hii kakuna chidi mbisoto. Kani chidi ya rigo muna Uganda, Uganda wange. Nene nsi ya fe guangali ya fe. Fetu ino didu wani ya temu lala. Banobo naba temu ababie tubagobe. Tubabola, bantu tubabogole reko. Nga wazeo jetubela. Tubagame gori mubi o mubi uyo, mubi uyo. Wala wana damu. Niwa jamu chashi, niwa jana ishtere yote buwa chensi mbize baba. Ni wateka mchachi ni kusanyuka nyo, tiba nange mweba le, mkoze nyo, mumu singa. Kwa shitegira. So, tinoku wako chitu kule chikenda kuteleze guangali ya fe. Tinoku wako chitu kule chikenda kuteleze Uganda. Fenda tuje ya gali lemu, nina wasu watu jawa wanubo na babi. Nesi ya fe rijo kula kulano. Umuka magwensa waba nkumire. Kijakua tundamu, bangu wangu mweraba.